I don't know. It, it just sounds like a law, like like gravity is a law. Yeah. But then you're talking about it as if you know you practice it, and so that's that's I think for me what is well, kind of confusing. It, Go ahead. Yeah. The reason it is called the law of attraction is because it is considered to always be active, whether you're conscious of it or not. Uh, your thoughts, your choices, and all that will attract certain things into your life, whether you're conscious of the existence of that law or not. That's the main reason why they call it the law of attraction, as opposed to, you know, the philosophy or the practice of attraction. I would say if you wanted to get into it tomorrow, you know, or you want to turn this off and you want to try out the law of attraction, I would, you know, just look up the exercises and start doing them. You know, I, I wouldn't make any claims or promises to anybody about what it will or will not do. I've seen... I've seen a plethora of different exercises that people do um, from, you know, there's the vision board. I'll start with that because that's the one, that's the stereotypical one. But, um, basically with the vision board, what you're doing is you're taking the pictures, of everything you want, and you put them on a poster board or on a bulletin board or something. And you look at that every day to remind you of what your goal is. Okay, that's usually one of the first things people do. Okay. Um, another method is you put every you know you write everything down on a list and you know you kind of you focus your intentions on it for so much time a day or um, some people uh, just, they take their law of attraction journal and they log their progress if it's something really big that they're trying to get. Um, so there's a lot of there's also. Uh, what they call the uh, 555 method, where people, and I, I haven't tested this one, but, um, people mm. are saying it's really, like, it's, it's helping them out, but basically right. you write, um, uh, you write an affirmation down 55 times, five times a day, and that gets, supposedly gets these people into the, the mindset or whatever, I don't, I haven't practiced it. Okay. Um, it's it's a fairly new. I don't know uh, exactly when it it just suddenly became popular on the internet. So, but that sounds really you know, really good. I like that yeah. one. Okay. What I normally do is I go through a meditation if I can every day. From, okay. You know, fifteen is fifteen to twenty minutes. Mm -hmm. And that's mainly because I've been doing it long enough that it doesn't take me as long to get into the mindset. Right. Um, okay. 